Do you have a sore neck? If you do, you really want to do exactly what I do, pay attention, watch closely, and, and be amazed. Okay, so let's start off by just rotating your head to one side, coming back to center, rotating your head to the other side, coming back to center. How did that feel? Any pain, any strain, any decreased range of motion? Did it feel different from right side to left side? Make a mental note or watch yourself uh, do it. You can videotape yourself and you can see. A lot of times people will do this and then they'll do this. So those are things to look for. Now, I want you to do this exercise. So relax your shoulders, tuck, give yourself, I call it a double chin. You can call it a chin tuck, just do it gently. Do it gently, don't strain it. Don't do that, because it'll just create more compression in your spine, and that's not what we're trying to do. We're trying to decompress your spine right now. All right, now, you're gonna tuck your chin. Beautiful. Now, you're gonna put your shoulder blades slightly together. You've got your spine, your shoulder blades, just put them slightly, slightly together, okay? Slightly, don't do a big one and and really stick out your chest? No. Slightly shoulder blades together, slight chin tuck. Relax your shoulders. If you can, this is a bonus, breathe into your belly. This may be challenging for a lot of you because the second you go to think about your breath, you do this. So if that's the case, don't worry too much about your breath, just don't hold it. Okay, for those of you that can belly breathe, go for it. That'll be a bonus, it'll be helpful. Shoulder blades slightly together, slight chin tuck, now I want you to slowly rotate to the side. Good, you can inhale and then exhale. Awesome. Other side, re reset it because you probably lost it, some of you. Reset the chin tuck shoulder blades. Don't forget to breathe. Rotate. Come back. One more time. Reset the shoulder blades, reset the chin, and rotate. Come back to center. Shoulder blades, chin tuck, slight. Don't jam your neck. Rotate, come back. Now, release all that and now just rotate like you're retesting what you just tested at the very beginning. Write in the comments below what you found. Do a few more reps if you felt uh, not a big change. If you didn't feel a big change and you've done a few reps of these, I recommend doing this three times a day, only three or four times each side, and then retest it. Because you have now a benchmark of how it feels. You can even videotape yourself and re-videotape yourself. Because when you do that, then you know that what you're doing is working, right? Okay, so if you felt pain relief immediately, which so many people do, um, then, Obviously keep doing this exercise. If you didn't, keep doing it and then keep retesting to see if you start to feel a shift. Now, why does this work? Why is it so simple? The reason why there's so much pain and strain around our neck and our low backs, our, our whole spine, is because there's tiny, tiny little muscles that connect from bone to bone to bone to bone to bone. And guess what? They're called posture muscles. They work really hard. And when there's pain or strain or crappy posture, they really don't do their job right. They kind of, I call it snoozing. It doesn't necessarily mean they're super weak. They just need to be woken up. And how are they woken up? With proper movement patterns. It's not really rocket science, but it actually kind of is, right? So now, if I do what we just did, shoulder blades slightly together, slight chin tuck, relax my shoulders, keep my breath going without breathing like this, like so many people do with neck pain. And then if I just move in the way we were designed to move and come back, what am I doing? I'm waking up my posture muscles. I'm waking them up. That's all I'm doing. When we move and breathe the way we were designed to, magic happens because all we're doing is changing the pattern. We're interrupting that pain pattern, that strain pattern for even just a moment and you may be surprised how much relief you get. Now, is the pain going to come back in 20 minutes? Maybe, because guess what? You've, they're snoozing again. <laughs> 
So practice, 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 and let me know how it goes. This one is so simple and so profound. I can't recommend it enough. Alrighty. Take care. See you next time. Bye-bye.